Hello and welcome to CAD Drive. After watching this tutorial, you are going to create how to sheet how to create sheet metal parts in Siemens NX. You will be able to use tab and flange commands in Siemens NX. So let's get started. First, we have to create this base face in sheet metal part. So go to Sketch, select this plane, and create a rectangle. Let's dimension this rectangle. This vertical length will be 150 mm and this length will be 100. Exit the sketch. Now we have to add thickness to this planar sheet. So, so go to tab command, select the sketch, define the thickness of 1 mm, click on OK and you can see now our 1 mm thickness sheet is ready now we have to create flanges at both sides so go to flange command select this edges of this sheet and at this option toolbar please select full width option and the from length please define length value of 50 mm at angle of 90 and length roughness will be inside and band will be band material inside so our defined value of this sheet will remain 100 mm so click on ok now our two flanges has been created we have to create another flanges at 90 degree so uh, again select the flange command select this edge select this edge and we are here material is inside band is inside length is 50 mm let's define length of 35 mm angle is 19 so our two main flanges has been created now we have to create this two small small flanges at these two different faces so we have to create flanges select flange command now select this line and at the top of toolbar select width option go to at center at center and the width will of this flange will be 35 angle will be 90 length reference will be outside and material will be outside material is band material band is outside so you can see now after selecting band outside there is a no tear and wear at the sheet thickness the length will be here is 50 mm click on ok now again select a flange command for this side select a flange height of 35 25 mm height, 35 mm width, 25 mm height. Click on OK. Material is band is outside. So let's reselect this. Select this edge. Select the flange command. Select this edge select at the center material band outside select outside band outside select option at the center width is 10 mm length is 20 mm select band relief none let's define width of 35 now we have to create a flange select this edge select width is 35 length is 30 35. 
you can see now our sheet metal model is almost ready now we have to just create holes at this faces so go to sketch select this top of this branch plane click on ok and we now we are going to create two points and fully define these points and we are going to use hole so if you use hole feature it will be beneficial if you want to delete the feature or if you want to modify the whole dimension so this will be 35 divided by 2 and the distance from this to this will be 35 same for this from distance from this to this point is 35 From this plane to this point distance is 35 divided by 2. So good select come here to search bar and select hole. Select hole feature. And you can see now the dia has been given at 10 mm and the point will be selected now come here at search bar and select mirror feature select a mirror feature select a whole feature select the plane middle plane and click on ok and you can see now our mirror hole has been created now we have to break corner at this branch and this branch so select break corner Define radius of 17.5 and select this edges at which we are going to break the corner. Select this edge Click on OK and you can see now the fillet has been given at corner now we have to select again whole command we have to create hole at these two flanges dia will be 10 go to points and select this outer edge of this flange radius flange and you can see now the hole at center will be created same do for this flange also select hole select come into position select this edges arc center and click on ok and you can see now 10 mm hole has been created so that's very simple sheet metal tutorial for Siemens and X let's define color for this sheet select the body define use ctrl j and use object color of this and you can see now our sheet metal model has been ready for manufacturing purpose please make sure you like share and subscribe this channel for more videos and tutorial like this thank you for watching